Now, was it just me or did Katrina look a little less than pleased with all the on-stage cuddling? Perhaps she's just shy or wishing that he hadn't brought up the proposal that wasn't, which is perhaps our key to travel a little bit back in time. You see, Katrina may be in a New York state of mind right now, but she's also in the mood for some memories as Mayank Shaker found out. Here's Kat on how this romance actually started in the first place. The one question that you would always expect is one on Salman Khan, right? Uh, which I am going to ask you, but more in terms of how did you and Salman Khan meet in the first place? Well, uh, we met at a, at a function, at a, at a film function that um, that kind of happens, you know, every every so often. Every like it's a months. dozer for people uh, to get to know how to get uh, a girl like Katrina. Yeah. <laughs> that's, that's why the special being asked. It's like step by step process. No, you know, I will say one thing though that um, every person who who is part of my life, whether it's a man, it's a woman, it's my friend, um, whichever people have remained there with me as friends in whatever capacity, um, right. whether it's from Anna Singh, who's my first friend in in the country, to all the other people uh, up until date, it's always been a very instantaneous thing with me. It's always been something uh, that when something I look into clicks. that, something like clicks. And when it when it just doesn't, it just it never it never does again. It's always been that way with me. It's very instantaneous. It is said that pretty much everything in the world right now runs on either sex or money. This is this is what human life has been centered on. Uh, you're already a sex goddess. Uh, or considered the sexiest woman in planet Earth by FHM and various other magazines. I want to know what you do with your money. Where is it that you spend your money? How many apartments do you have? I'm not a tax man, so you can say that. No, I have one house, which is which is a family house, uh, my family house, and then I have a, one apartment in Bandra, mm -hmm. uh, which is where I live. And in terms of investing, you know, the, there's a lot of people I know who who invest in art very heavily, and they invest in the stock market, and they they know how to do that stuff, but. I've always been a little on the safer side, and I know some people say safe is boring, but I, I just feel that you know you work really hard for your money. This industry is one that um, it's not it's not a lifelong career. Sometimes, sometimes right. it is for you know 15, 20 years. You have to be careful with what you earn and with right. what you do. So um, for the most part, I, I I'm pretty safe with my investments. If it's just property What's a safe or. Investment? I think property is a fairly right. safe investment, right. or then just putting it in, in, a, in a fund or you know right. something like that. So are you telling me that after working in so many films and often so many have been like high grossing movies, mm -hmm. you've picked up an apartment in Bandra, that's it? Yeah. <laughs> really? Well, I hope you pick up more apartments, I hope you get better movies too. Thank you very much.